Hi, I'm Jake, Vice President of Strategic Initiatives here at Ready. Today we're going to take a look at a brand new feature in Forge OS 5.1, three-point frames. And three-point frames will allow you to align to any surface in your environment and is great for adjusting and realigning that surface when something might shift in your work cell. Let's take a look. Let's start by taking a look at how to create a three-point frame. Let's go into Task Canvas. Now here we see a task that we've created specifically to demonstrate the utility of three-point frames. If we come into the Frame Manager, we'll see the frames that we've currently created, including one that we're using for this demonstration, using our brass parts. Creating a three-point frame is done simply by selecting the three-point frame in the new menu. Now the three-point frame is defined using three points in space. First is the origin point of the Cartesian coordinate frame or frame of reference. The second point is the point defining the direction of the x-axis of that Cartesian coordinate frame. And the third point defines the direction of the y-axis. The demonstration that we've programmed will pick the brass castings from the grid. We use the three-point frames to align the robot to pick parts out of the grid, place the parts on the table, and then return them back to the grid again. This can be extremely useful in production when attempting to be very precise with the robot's movements. If there is a surface that isn't flat or a large area to cover, you want to make sure that you can reliably move the robot in the X, Y, and Z directions relative to that surface. We've seen that the robot has successfully been able to interact with the parts on this surface. But let's say that process constraints require us to change the position of this tray to here. Now the robot is no longer able to interact with the parts because it's not aligned to the surface. This is the beauty of the three-point frame. I can just realign the points I used to define the surface in the first place without having to make any changes to the waypoints or the grid and be able to immediately update and interact with the parts successfully again. With the probe, we've successfully been able to redefine each of the points used to define our three-point frame. Now we can swap back in the tool and see how it works. Now that we've got a three-point frame realigned, let's run it and take a look. So we started with our parts presentation fixture in one location. Use the three-point frame to align to the surface because it's at an odd angle. Made it very easy to work with. But our process changed and we had to move our parts presentation fixture. Using the three-point frame feature, we were able to very quickly realign where that surface was and we're up and running in no time. Three-point frames can help simplify your workflow and make complex programming easy with Forge OS. Thanks for joining us for this software spotlight. If you'd like more information, check out our website at ready-robotics.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.